I'm Ken Adams, and it's my pleasure to serve as mayor of the City of Olive Branch. It's March the 15th. We'd like to talk briefly about an event that took place in Olive Branch on March the 11th around 1.43 a.m. It involved one of our law enforcement officers that conducted a traffic stop on State Highway 302 near Kraft Goodman Road. An officer-involved shooting took place after that. Uh, we definitely want to send the message that says with zero tolerance, it's not the type of thing we want in our community and our city. Uh, I'm going to turn this over in a moment to a couple more professionals that will tell you some other things about this. But I did want to thank the Olive Branch Police Department, DeSoto County Sheriff's Department, the law enforcement professionals from Missouri, from the Springfield area, and the U.S. Marshals uh, for being involved in this situation and, and working jointly with the City of Olive Branch to, to take care of this situation. Uh, I also want to thank several citizens. Within an hour after the picture of the suspect was pulsed out, within an hour I had Uh, very quickly and that's what took place in this case and uh, with that I'll turn this over now to uh, our chief of police Bill Cox thank you mayor I would just like to follow that up by stating that we on March the 14th uh, we officers of the Olive Branch Police Department went to Springfield Missouri uh, and brought uh, mr. tolls back to Olive Branch to stand charges uh, that to face the charges that he is uh, currently facing I would like to add my thanks to our surrounding agencies here in DeSoto County and in Shelby County for their assistance and support during this incident. Special thanks to the members of the Springfield, Missouri Police Department and the United States Marshal Service for their actions in apprehending Colby Tolls. I would also like to thank the citizens of Olive Branch for your prayers, your support, and your assistance in providing information that led to the identification of this subject. And I would like to also say I just want to reiterate uh, what the, the mayor and chief had have put out there that we do have a zero tolerance for this type of conduct. I'm thankful for them to include us in the very beginning of this process so we can make sure that all the pieces are together, that we can ultimately uh, prosecute this case to the fullest. I've uh, been in meetings with investigators and uh, it is my opinion that uh, we now have enough information to upgrade this from an aggravated assault to two attempted murders of a police officer, uh, both of which would carry a potential for life sentence. We think that that is the, the right outcome in a case like this, so we will proceed aggressively from the start. Considering uh, Mr. Tolls fled to Missouri, uh, he is obviously a flight risk, and you consider the fact that he would go out of his way to shoot at two police officers, he's clearly a threat to society. I believe warrants a involved from the beginning to the end of this case to make sure that uh, our police are always uh, backed up and supported the way that uh, they deserve. I also want to make mention and, and let the citizens of All Branch be aware that the police here are elite, that this is a fantastic group. They've worked very, very hard. Uh, they got answers quickly. They worked together uh, to, to eradicate this threat from our community and I will do everything I, I can to get this one across the finish line for them. Thank you. 